Rotoscoping is the ability to put an object behind something in your shot. So if you have uh, a tree, a person, a car, and you want to add a, a person walking behind the car, you need to trace the, the shape of the car for every frame of the shot so that you can put the car back on top of the person walking on behind it. So rotoscoping is the ability, the artist's ability, to trace around whatever the object is, in this case my example a car, to trace around the car in every frame. So if the camera is moving and the car is moving, the artist has to actually trace its outline in every frame of that shot. And then you can put something behind it. So that's what a rotoscope is. That's what a green screen does. That's why we use green screen. Green screen is automated rotoscoping in the sense that the computer can create the mat, the rotoscope for the person in front of the green screen, without an artist having to trace it. The downside to a green screen is you can't put a green screen everywhere. You can't put a green screen for a mile down the road when you're shooting a traveling shot of a car and you need to put something behind it. Green screens aren't that big, they're too difficult and would be too expensive. So in that example you have to rotoscope. If you were tracing me and you wanted to make a mat for me, you would trace my outline and then you would make a black and white mat where I'm either white and the background is black and wherever there is black you can put something else inside of there. So it's a, it's a way for the computer to distinguish an object in the front or behind something. Mm -hmm.